Good morning, Catawba Ridge. It's time for your Copper Heads Up. Today is Wednesday, March 2nd, hump day and Dr. Seuss's birthday. I don't know about you, but I grew up reading Dr. Seuss books, so today is a big deal. Now, last night in sports. Our girls basketball team's history-making road to state sadly came to an end last night, falling 36 to 44. We're so proud of them and can't wait to see what they do next year. Girls soccer lost their game two to one and put up a great fight. And tonight, our guys' tennis team is traveling across town to take on NAFO. With the ongoing conflict in Ukraine constantly making headline news, we decided to give you an inside look on our Copperhead's opinions on the matter. Take a look. Ukrainian officials, they say dozens of Ukrainian soldiers died. With the ongoing conflict and between Russia and Ukraine Europe. sweeping news across the nation, advancements in technology and social media have brought this European conflict directly to us. From TikTok to Instagram through the ability to share pictures and videos, our very own Catawba Ridge students have been given the ability to build their opinions on this event. We are, the way we look at it, and the news and stuff, it's going to be on the news so much. And especially if it starts to rapidly increase and get worse, it's only going to be more prevalent. It's kind of nerve-wracking because I'm about to turn 18 and I don't know what my future is going to look like now. While some students feel that this has a direct impact on their lives, others see it as a distant conflict. I would say it's something distant, you know, it's not really connected to me in any way, but it's definitely something that's scary to think about. Though this event is unpredictable, it is definite that news will continue to rapidly spread through social media. For Sierra and TV, I'm Felicia Boland. All right, that's all for today. Have a terrific day, and I'll see you back here tomorrow morning. For Sierra and TV, I'm Hunter Mattis.